This is the difference the one day makes, guys. It's, uh... 9.30 at night now. And I feel like garbage. Oh, I feel like absolute garbage. I've been puking for the last hour, probably. Just anything that'll come up. I just really, really, really want this phone call to come, or more so them to walk in my room and tell me that there's a liver here for me. Oh, I'm sore, I'm nauseous, which I can't spell, by the way. Tired. Had a great day with my wife, though. Um, she got to come and spend some time with me. I sent her home, hang out with our three year old, which was great because he needs it. Um, Tomorrow my mom comes, which will be nice. Oh, I just don't get it though, guys. I'm at the top of the list and there's nothing coming. There's literally nobody above me and I can't get a phone call. The waiting is killing me. And it's driving me nuts inside. I know that I'm a very, very, very particular case. But. I really just. I want to get this surgery done. It's, it's a. It's really hard knowing that you're at the top and that you can't get it done. And, um, you know, my last two transplants, I didn't know if it was coming or not. And so I just randomly get a phone call. They'd be like, hey, let's go. And this one, I know that I'm at the top and I know that it's coming. And I don't know if that is making it worse knowing that it's coming and that's what's causing so much pain and, and anxiety um, but there's definitely something different about it um, I'm having a hard hard time with this surgery and I'm not even to the surgery yet. So, um, thank you guys all for your support and for your prayers. I really, really appreciate it. Um, if you're new to the subscription, I am on my third liver transplant, um, waiting on it. I'm at the top of my list, the list. Um, got a meld score of 39, which is out of 40. Um, if you've been following along, 
you know that this is my third one and you know that I'm going to be a hard transplant. Either way, just uh, pray for me and my family and pray that everything goes smoothly and pray that, uh, that everything goes well during this transplant because there's a lot of things that could go wrong and it's a tough, 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 tough surgery and most doctors wouldn't even attempt it so I'm thankful for that thankful that this surgeon's going to attempt it. Um, this is after being diagnosed with bile duct cancer and having to go through treatment on it. And um, hoping that this surgery clears out that bile duct cancer. <sighs> um... Sorry, trying to catch my breath here. Um, excuse me. I'm at Tampa General Hospital down in Tampa, Florida. Um, just waiting and waiting and waiting for either a phone call or somebody to walk into my room. Because I'm currently admitted, as you can see. And, uh, I'm just not doing too well. So, um, if you guys have any, um, advice or donations or anything like that, I do have a GoFundMe set up. Um, if you go to liver transplant, I'm sorry, if you go to um, liveroperation.com, you will be redirected to my GoFundMe page, and you guys can donate there and help me out with some medical bills. That would be greatly appreciated. Um, there's going to be a lot, a lot of costs after this transplant and any kind of help would be great I can't tell you how much I appreciate how much you guys have already donated um, but there's still going to be more so <sighs> thanks for watching hit that subscribe button if you care and um, hit like if you like these videos but I know they're just kind of right in your face and kind of boring to watch, but spend the time watching them so that uh, YouTube will help me out also. And I will talk to you guys later. Thanks.